Where are you well, from? I'm from Brazil. You, you speak know? Portuguese? Yes. Esponita. Muito obrigada. Tu também. I'm intercontinental. I am from Brazil. <laughs> I'm intercontinental. <laughs> Baike, can you swim? Black men don't swim. <laughs> oi! Oi! Guys, please be, be, be advised that you're on camera. Yeah. It's not by choice. It's not by choice. It's not by choice. It's not by choice. <laughs> yeah, guys, if you're not comfortable, you can leave. <laughs> I'm joking, I'm joking. I mean, you see, Nami? No problem. I'm going to get a tackle. 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 Ah, we got you so now I'm a chocolate jacket. Yes. Well, okay. Why did you not take it home? Guys, can I see Joy? How do you come? You made us sad. I can't even stop it. Only you have that. It's only you. Don't put everybody there. So now you want us to make one. Yeah, I make the rules. You make the rules, but the rules are so like a side. Actually, look for you like Okay, okay, have a happy. Okay, good. Yeah. <laughs> cool now, cool. All oh, cool. Great family, this is Wilfred. Thank you so much for clicking on our video. This is part two of the beach day series. All right, guys, as you can see, we're at the beach right now. And again, you guys have been subscribing to our videos. Thank you so much for that. We're going to be checking out the beach. I'm going to even have interviews with some guests, you know? And by the way, before we get into the other stuff, I want to let you know that I'm from Wilfred Intercontinental Agency. We help with applications abroad, university applications, scholarships, and all that. Okay, so stay tuned and stay connected. All right. in the things that we think, in the things that we say, the things that we do. Make our hearts thankful for what you provided for today. In Jesus' name, amen. Amen. Thank you, Ryan. Okay. All right, guys, we have another interview here. Hello, how are you doing? I'm good. How are you? I'm all right. What's your name? Edith. What's Edith. yours? My name is Wilfred. Nice to meet you. Where are you oh. from? I'm from Brazil. Edith, you serious now? I'm from Brazil. You speak now. Portuguese? Yes. Oh, Portuguese. Esponita. Muito obrigada. Uh, tu também. I'm intercontinental. I am from Brazil. <laughs> I'm intercontinental. <laughs> In that serious. All right. I think now we are also intercontinental because now we are from Brazil. Yes. Apparently. Yeah. Where in Brazil? Rio de Janeiro. Yeah. Is that in Portuguese? Yes. I am from Brazil. I'm intercontinental. <laughs> I speak Portuguese. <laughs> Wait, Edith. So what are you studying? <laughs> 
Um, business administration. Which which year? Uh, th this is my second year. This is you my second. You are still a newbie. Yes. Okay, okay. Why, why do you choose business administration? Because money is important. You love money, Edith. I money also love money. Money is important. Money is important. Yes. So we agree on that. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not a case money, okay? I love money. We love money. Yeah. All right. But Edith, mm -hmm. what, what can you say about your, 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 your course so far? Is it showing you pepper or are you showing it pepper? It's showing me pepper. <laughs> <laughs> like hot, 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 spicy. By the way, I used to see you on campus confused going to print out things. Uh, Dennis Plaza. Why are you lying? <laughs> They're watching you, Edith. You, you print out things. But you look, you look like, a, like a real student, huh? like a serious student. No, uh, on I campus. Because I am a serious student. What do you mean? Don't I look serious right now? Edith. Yeah? We, we both know each other. Are you sure that you're that serious? Yeah. Okay, Edith, you're a serious student. And last, what can you say about the event? This event is amazing, guys. Yeah. And like, the fact that we are just putting God above everything. It's just the vibe is so good. Sure. Like, uh, I love it here. Okay, they pick me fine. Guys, we're shooting a video here. People are just doing this. Why now? But we tap into it. Do you get what I mean? Yes. Yeah, yeah. Do you understand the concept? Yes. So the scripture was written for us, not to us. Yeah. It was written for us, not to us. All right, great. So why was it written? There's a lot of reasons why this uh, the book of James was written, but I already gave you the answer. But that's not the only answer. What are the answers? You should allow the knowledge. Because what James is doing is first reminding them of the faithfulness of God, reminding them of what God will do. So because he has reminded you of what God will do, hence do not doubt. And then if you still if you know that God is faithful, but yet Alright guys, basically we have our first guest here. Big man, how are you doing? I'm good. How are you? I'm alright. What's your name? Michael. What's yours? I'm over. I'm from Nigeria. Which part of Nigeria? Just. Joss. And I know Joss is very cold. Yeah, it is. It's just like UK. I'm intercontinental. I am from Nigeria and I am from Joss. <laughs> Guys, as I said, I am from Joss. I'm intercontinental. So, Michael, uh, I know that you are into coding and programming, right? Yeah. So, what, what secret would you put or any, any tips you can tell people who love coding, like myself? Oh, who love coding? Yeah. yeah. Keep coding. Solve real problems. That's it. So, what can you say about coding? and uh, I don't know yeah if you're not working with chat GPT I don't know what you're doing you have to work with code anyway oh chat GPT can code now yeah it can is you it should, fast you should work with it is it helping you yeah the paid one is fast <laughs> <laughs> the, the unpaid one isn't so uh, yeah but is it, is it, do you think it's, it's competitive yeah it, it, it does help it helps you with uh, like it's like Google like googling you don't have to Google oh, too much yeah, sure. so it helps you helps yeah you to some extent yeah so and I think to what extent do you think it is going to replace uh, human coders like yourself? <laughs> oh no, we can't be replaced because <laughs> to replace programmers you have to actually accurately describe what you want. Oh yeah. And uh, most human beings can't do that. But programmers can't. So. Makes sense. It makes sense. That makes sense. Okay, what can you say about the event? What are you looking forward to in terms of the event and today's, today's event? Uh, yeah, I'm just looking forward to building relationships with people, not sure. people outside, you know outside of the, the building and seeing how they are that's it all right okay. michael again i think we might um have some comments in terms of the weather the confusion they put the weather here what can you say a few oh, comments it's a nice weather it's just it's not summer yet it's not winter nice weather just nobody should go swim <laughs> let's show them a bit because it's it's quite guys according to michael nobody should go and swim <laughs> it's, it's totally unsafe to swim there's no lifeguard if you go you're gone nobody's going to come for you Michael, can you swim? Black men don't swim. Hi! <laughs> Hi! I didn't hear that. Guys, alright, guys. Black people don't swim. It's true. Can you swim? You see? I can swim very well. I've been swimming my whole life. <laughs> alright, Michael. Once again, anything you can say, your last, your, your last words for now? 
that's what I don't know. Stay safe. <laughs> As for them, <laughs> everybody, guys, stay safe. All right, guys, that's my kid. We continue with the interviews, and yeah, stay tuned. Cut. Your lines are not clear, your lines are not clear. I will show him a word and he or she is going to draw it and then okay. the team will try to okay. guess like what the word is. Me and her. 